Good evening and welcome to 22 News at 6. I'm Barry Krieger. And I'm Alicia Rodriguez. That fire badly damaged a Connecticut River landmark today. 22 News reporter Ryan Walsh standing by live at Brunel's Marina in South Hadley where a longtime family business literally went up in smoke. The state fire marshal is still trying to figure out how this fire started, but we know the fire did start in the ceiling of the Dockside restaurant, and you can just see the amount of damage that was done. It's been a tough start, been a tough summer. You know, 2013 is a tough year. Brunel's Marina co-owner Luke Brunel had to watch as his family business was burning down. No one was inside when the fire started around 6.30 in the morning, and no one was hurt. It did take firefighters about an hour to get it under control. There were some materials in there, um, like some gasoline and, and other things stored, uh, pressurized cans. But the, the main difficulty was being up in the ceiling. We just could not get to it. And uh, once the air got to it, it took off. South Hadley Fire Captain Jim Pula told 22 News the restaurant is completely destroyed. But just a few yards away, you can see the docks and all the boats on the river are completely fine. One boat owner told 22 News he got an up-close look at this fire. It looked like little smoke, right, and then all of a sudden it just blew up black and just blurred first in the flames. Brunel told 22 News they're going to rebuild in the long term, but in the short term... This will pass. We'll move on. We're, we're not quitting. We're going to set up. We'll be back in business here in a couple days. Brunel says they may work out of an intent until they can start building again. Live in South Hadley, Ryan Walsh, 22 News.